Hi folks, Max from uh, Galaxy Note 3 Root.com for this week's Verizon Note 3 ROM of the week. Check out HyperDrive ROM. Uh, this is probably one of the best ROMs for the Verizon Note 3. Um, it does come with two cameras as you can see here. Uh, Android 4.3 Photosphere camera. Uh, working flawless out of the box. Looking pretty, pretty good there. Uh, and also video recording working just fine. And also you do have a full photosphere so you can get um, your favorite photosphere photos uh, on your phone. So that's nice. Um, some basic functionalities there. And also it does come with pop-up browser and also does come with uh, the hotspot working out of the box. Um, so you don't have to do anything. Just turn it on and it, wor it will work. You won't get uh, any of those... Uh, annoying um, messages from Verizon. So very nice stuff and let's actually go take a look at some of the other stuff. It does come with Viper 4 Android which is my favorite audio mod. Um, definitely works well on all Note 3's. I do have a full demo of it. Um, check it out. You may have to install it. I do recommend super audio quality um, for the best audio tweaking. Uh, of course do that and make sure you reboot and then you'll be able to make full use of it and also there are hidden uh, advanced menus so make sure you go here set UI setting to uh, expert I do have a full tutorial guide on this um, check the take a look if you have headphones or large speakers uh, watch that video with the sound on and you will be amazed uh, it is awesome audio app so it does come with that and also of course the heart of this ROM is hyperdrive tweaks uh, let me show you the main menu here. Um, you will be able to customize a bunch of stuff. Uh, customize your extended power menu here. So you can actually get rid of all of these. So let's say you only use uh, the torch. Then you can make it nice and clean and simple. Nice way to uh, customize it just the way you want to. Also does have pen window control app. Uh, of course that will allow you to add all of your favorite apps to your uh, pen window here. Um, so I will not show you that. I also have a full video guide on that so take a look at that if you don't know what that means. Also uh, LMT Pi controls um, you can get uh, on-screen uh, Pi controls set your favorite shortcuts like I did here um, makes your life easier when you're using one hand. Um, definitely recommend it. I also have a full tutorial guide on that Yes, I have a full tutorial guide on all these features, including the app settings. Uh, this is called the Expose app settings. You'll be able to run your favorite apps in custom DPI mode, change the font size. Um, this is great for those of you uh, farsighted or nearsighted, or I think farsighted. Um, as you get older, you know you can't see the letters well. You can go into it, uh, tweak the DPI, tweak the font, and make it look bigger. Uh, some additional user interface stuff here. Um, you get a full Wanam Expose app, uh, which is great, obviously. You may have to enable this um, in Expose app settings. So let me actually go back here. Uh, go to Expose Framework right after you install the ROM. Go to the Framework and make sure you hit Install Updates. Uh, make sure those two numbers turn green. And once that's done, go to the Modules. Enable um, the stuff you want, the Wanam Expose I was talking about and also expose app settings if you want that you do have to enable it enable all the modules you want and reboot uh, and you'll be able to uh, use any of the mo these modules and let me go ahead and show you some other stuff here uh, boot animation you can disable it enable it um, you can uh, enable additional toggles torch Wi-Fi hotspots uh, brightness so you can see I have a quick torch here which is nice and some more toggles, Wi-Fi hotspot. Uh, also, you can get on-screen buttons if you want on-screen buttons. Maybe your buttons are broken or you just prefer the on-screen buttons. Um, you can enable that also. Also, show network speed. Um, that will show you the network speed up here, which is really nice. I really like it. I really dig that feature, especially I'm downloading something or you know, download new apps, and sometimes they they will download um, stuff in the background, and that kind of uh, allows you to monitor all of that. Uh, in Toolbox here you get additional uh, features and also uh, in Advanced, some more stuff there. Um, 
then that's pretty much it as far as battery life and performance should be pretty darn good this is probably one of the best ROMs uh, I've been actually using it for a couple of weeks and I just pff, I just uh, haven't had time to uh, make a video but definitely this is uh, this and my jelly beans ROM is my two of my favorite ROMs for the Verizon Note 3 and also you do have hyperdrive hub uh, where you can download some useful um, toggles and also keyboard skins if you like different colors a uh, font installer here and also icon changer and add-ons um, additional wallpapers uh, you can boost your sound using the volume hack if you want to um, also awesome note HD um, so definitely check it out for this week's round of the week and this little power button is pretty cool too um, nice nice stuff so one of the best ROMs you can get for the Verizon Note 3 um, this is pretty much stock ROM with lots of cool features added and definitely if you're still using stock I mean you know why are you using a Note 3 um, no you should really root it and uh, install custom ROM such as this one um, definitely way better than stock and as always if you like this ROM don't forget to donate to the developer of this ROM Esprit 94 at XDA and also, um, don't forget to subscribe to my email list at galaxynote3root.com. We update you once a week with Ramal Louis tips, hacks, and more. And thanks guys for watching my video. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button and the subscribe button below here uh, to get more cool ROM reviews, tips, tricks, and more. And also check out video of the week over here if you haven't yet. And as always, uh, stay here on Android.